Hey, friendo, Steve here. Welcome back to Wrestle Juice. Once again, we're going to watch some old wrestling commercials. These things are hilarious. We've watched 1984, 1985, and thanks to the wrestling club with Darren and Brett, what I think is a now defunct wrestling podcast. In their wake, they left a bunch of these compilations of wrestling commercials throughout the years. So we're going to go back to 1986 when I was eight years old and I was already living in England because I was a military brat and my dad had us sent over to England. If you recall, 1984's crop of wrestling commercials prior to WrestleMania, uh, like a year before WrestleMania, were all kind of run of the mill. They were like Jesse Ventura uh, pushing a convenience store in Milwaukee. Fast forward a year, WWF had blown up. WrestleMania was on the horizon. Hogan was everything. They even had a Hogan workout kit that, that they couldn't even get Hogan to do the commercial, so they got Mr. Wonderful Paul Orndorff. So let's see what 1985, it's a great little time capsule, these things. So let's look at 1986 in pro wrestling commercials. Did he just say Chunkamania? Is this a, some sort of candy bar? Listen to Jesse say, chunky chili beef soup. <laughs> oh, I love this chunky chili beef soup, you know. With a fork. Bark. Paul, Mr. Wonderful Orndorff uses a spoon. Man, okay, number one, who's eating? Only Piper would eat soup with a fork. Spoon. Fork. Let's find fork. out who rules. <laughs> They're fighting over how to eat soup? I mean, this is a no con. This is this, this, Piper's in the wrong here. He he with a with a spoon. <laughs> that guy called him a bum. Chili beef with big Dude, yeah, how are you gonna get any of the broth with a fork? Some beef, the soup that eats like a meal. Fork or spoon, it's awesome. Good lord, could you imagine how much you're blowing up your bathroom after eating that shit? Better help. Comedian's gonna run wild. And no one Mr. T. Tag team. I'm sorry, the A team. Whoa, whoa, wait, wait, wait a second. Hold on. Wait a second. So does Mr. T play Mr. T in this? Is Hulk Hogan playing Hulk Hogan, or is Mr. T playing B. A. Baracus? <laughs> Brother. Oh, man, you know, they wouldn't ever let anybody get killed in that show. They would like have hella guns and like in car like chases and stuff, but they wouldn't allow people to die in that show. They were the dude. What the heck? What? Oh, shit. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Ice cream with, who is that, Bull Nakano? It's here on 1986 World Wrestling Federation's calendar. Oh, hell yeah. Sweaty Andre in January. Oh, there you go. Hey, that's my month right there. Is that, who is that? In the commercial vehicle arena. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Jesus, that was a nasty bump. Who was that? Was that Orndorff? In the commercial vehicle arena, times are tough. <laughs> you gotta put your arms out, man. Come on, even I know that. But Toyota's not lying down just when you need them most. Dude, somebody throw up the X. Toyota's there it is. They threw up the game. X. The deals <laughs> we got a man down. The competition before are back and more powerful. Ow! Toyota's already Why does it sound like they're falling on concrete? On top, and we've got the deals to keep us there. But terrific deals must end June 28th. So for the deal of the year, see your terrific Toyota dealer. Why? Why June 28th? Why is it necessary to end that deal then? If I come in June 29th, you tell me I'm not going to get the same deal as the day before. I'm oh, sorry, I'm not going to sell you this car. No. Oh, what a feeling. Toyota. Whoa, hold on. There are two ways to get color pictures of. Oh, it's the Von. Let's say it's the Von Eriks. Who's that guy in the back? Is that fake Von Eric? Hold on a second. What's Lance? Is that MJF back there? That looks like Lance Von. Then maybe that's Lance Von Eric. Wrestlers like the Von Eriks pick up your free poster in Sunday's Times Herald or try to take a few from their family album. You're not a real Von Eric. God damn it. 
Was that was that a tiger noise? What the hell? Tuesday, an ESPN slams and jams Ooh. special. Slams and jams, baby. Oh shit! <laughs> oh god, throw up the X. The bombers in a that looked horrible. Hair pulling, back breaking roller derby war. Both teams' colors will become oh, black fuck. and blue. I feel like roller derby is more dangerous than wrestling, to be honest with you. You're going like at high speeds and just being wiped out. No helmet. Oh, God. Monday, Stop April cutting off his air. Tickets now on sale at the forum and all tickets. Oh, look at Hogan. He's got the Lex Luger rib tape on. Look at that. Wait, hold on a second. Look at this again. Look, once again, Hulk Hogan looks like he's being played by a different person. Like, look at, like, he's got more forehead than he does face. Look at that. It's changing. His lips are different. His old chin is different. It's all different. Oh, here we go. Nintendo. Yeah. Oh, that is not safe. Oh, here we go. Oh, she missed. Oh, there we go. AWA action on the Nintendo. Oh, heck yeah, man. <laughs> that was rad. The disc system from Nintendo. Big match at my house. Here we go. You have yours. I've got Junkyard Dog. That kid's like 16 years old. Why is he playing with toys? Why is Junkyard Dog in his house? Federation Superstars. I've got food as beefcake. <laughs> oh, dude, Junkyard Dog wins. Here's George the Animal Steel. Yeah, he's all right. So far, I feel like JYD still wins. Ricky the Dragon Steel. Yeah. They're so real. And Rowdy Rock Piper. There we go. There's Piper, but he's trying to eat his soup with a fork. Can you tell the difference? Yeah. Yeah, because, like, WWF superstars are, like, actual people, and these are dolls. Yeah. Yeah. Can you tell the difference? <laughs> real. Each sold separately from LJN. Yeah. Where's Hogan? Oh, there's the man, Inoki. Versus Bruiser Brody with a suit, looking like a million bucks. Nope. All right. Listen up. Here. Joe's in trouble. Whoa, here we go. <laughs> hey, Joe. Was this guy actually part of the Marines? Let's go. Don't mess with Sergeant Slaughter. He wasn't actually in the military. But the one thing he can't do is claim that he's actually in the Marines. This triple T tank. Sergeant, Sergeant. What a terrible tank. It just leaves him. Look at that. People shooting at him. They're going to hit more him. <laughs> he's like shielding the tank from fire, from like gunfire. Slaughter is now a part of G.I. Joe. G.I. A real Sergeant Slaughter is now a part of G.I. Joe because they didn't do a background check. Lift the adventure of G.I. Joe. And hey, look out, Cobra. Sergeant Slaughter. Fake it till you make it, Cobra. When it comes with triple T tank, Cobra figures and equipment sold separately. <laughs> oh God, so violent. I wasn't a G.I. Joe kid when I was when I was a, when I was a kid. I wasn't in G.I. Joe. Next. Harley Race, next. What is this? Toys? Are you the new Battle Royale? An exciting board game. Oh, hell. Oh, look at that. Kowalski. is real wrestling. The power, the moves, the excitement. With Pro Wrestling's Battle Royale, you're in the ring. But you're not. You're just at a table with like a chunk of cardboard and some car look, There's not even any wrestlers like faces on that. There is a ring in the middle, though. In Battle Royale, you're the wrestler. Rules are clear. Four can play. Excitement mounts as you... Why are there grown adults playing this game? <laughs> that never happened. I will guarantee you in the history of that game, grown adults never played it. Wipe out your opponents. My face rate could clean up Central Park. Defender spins. Far an object. I win. <laughs> okay, Billy Crystal. <laughs> Far an object. I win. <laughs> you got DQ'd, sucker. Battle Royale is real wrestling. It's fun. Get Battle Royale today. It's not real. Where do you get that, Killer Kowalski? Who are those jabronis on the cover? That's terrible. They didn't even license, like, Vern Gagne. They couldn't license, like, the Funks or something. It's just two dude. There's one guy. <laughs> look at the look at the G-string that guy's wearing on the right. 
Battle Royale is available only on TV. Call to- Did Killer Kowalski make that game? Free 1-800-554-8000. Order now at 19.95 and get three free issues of Pro Wrestling Illustrated, a $6 oh, nice. value. Oh, Thank did Pro Wrestling Illustrated make that game? <laughs> Calibrate. When you're under pressure and you need to get away, the Toyota 4Runner is the perfect escape vehicle. Oh, man. He's like, I'm getting counted out. So I can go hightail it with this lady. Toyota 4Runner. You can't beat it. A lot of feeling. <laughs> Beautiful breakaway. <laughs> Just because you can do a picture in picture doesn't necessarily mean you should do a picture in picture. The Toyota Hilux oh, here we go. Cab gets four Who's in this one? To the job. What it makes light work a big three quarter ton payload. Toyota Hilux. Uh, a couple of young boys it. setting up the ring. The size of those ropes, those look exceedingly big. Crew and cargo. Kill bees. Copyright strike for everybody. St. Paul Orndorff is Mr. Wonderful. 1976-2929. Here from all. God damn it. Cowboy, I want products. Here we go. Smash or pound the Toyota. Hey, that's my truck. There's no way you can break it. A lot of feeling. <laughs> they, had, they had George Steele do the jump. Unbreakable. Toyota. Nothing you got nothing to say. It's Captain Lou Alberto here on my bicycle. Remember now, safety, safety in life, and safety with your bicycle. Have reflectors, have your bike inspected. God bless you all out there. Now turn in hotline, call in. Your favorite wrestlers, Captain talking about him, Roddy Piper, Hulk Hogan. Whoa, 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 Captain Albano. Wait a second. I thought you were talking about bicycle safety. I was like, number one, where's your helmet? I don't think people had helmets back in the 80s. I know I didn't. But number two, is this for bicycles, bicycle safety or is this or is this for a, a hotline? 916 is Sacramento. Should I call that number? I'm not going to call that number. I should call that number. What happens if I call that number? Let's find out. Uh, let's see here. 916... Nine seven six seven two six eight. The call you are attempting to place is not allowed from this line. <gasps> Please dial six one one for customer service or dial one eight hundred three three one zero five zero zero from a landline phone. Desde esta línea no se permite hacer esta llamada. I don't do any of that. So far, you got Freddie Blassie, you got Tito Sun, got them all together. Don't be afraid to turn to your parents for safety tips. They won't turn you wrong. Turn to your parents, safety tips by Captain Lou Albert. Oh, that is, so you call that for additional safety tips. But Lou, you just gave us all the safety tips we need. Kids, hear Captain Lou Albano talk about keeping... <laughs> it's a safety? Did WWF have to do that for like... Because they lost a lawsuit or something? Safe. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yes, whoa, safe. brother, look at that. He looks nothing like he did in that last picture of him, in the last video we had of him. Hanging and banging every week. If you want to see Hanging and banging, brother. Slinging that cocaine right at my veins, brother.